Hi all, let us see the demo of Smart Shopping Platform. Now first let us see the components required. This is the load cell which is used to calibrate the weight of the item. It, its value is measured in grams. Maximum weight of this load cell is 10 kgs. Now this is HX711. It is a 24 bit analog to digital converter. It is used to get measurable data out from a load cell. This is the RFID tag. It is used to identify a particular item. Now this is the RFID reader which reads the RFID tag. This is the Wi-Fi mo module which is used to send data to the cloud. And this is Arduino we are using which processes the data. Let's see the working of this project. Here is the load cell and this is the RFID reader. This is the RFID tag which uniquely identifies an item and the item placed here is soap. Each soap piece contain, uh, is weighing 250 gram and here total 500 grams weight is placed. Now we will see the weight in the serial monitor. Initially 500 grams is showing. Here to see the shopping list first we have to log in using username and password. Initially no items to be purchased is showing because we have set a threshold of 300 gram. When an item weighs less than 300 grams it will come into the shopping list. Here 500 grams weight is kept initially. Now if we remove this 500 gram. Now we remove one piece of soap. Now this should show 250 gram weight in the serial monitor. Now it is showing 250 gram which is placed on the load cell. As it is less than the threshold value set by us that is 300. Now this item it should be shown in the app. That is this item soap should show in the app. Now this is the shopping list we have to purchase. Now we can share this shopping list and to share we have used WhatsApp API. Here when we click share button it opens our WhatsApp. Now if we send this this will be sent to the user. By clicking this user can know what is our shopping list. We have used another API to check the nutrient nutrition value of the item. If we click on nutrient check, it opens a web page which is of nutrition x API used. We have to give here the item consumed by us. That is if we give bread for example. It shows the nutrition fact of the bread. This is all about our project smart shopping platform in which uh, briefly we send the item to the shopping list in an app via cloud.